is indispensable in all of our lives. Food trade plays an important role in the global economy. For food to be traded, a number of measures have to be complied with to ensure its safety and to guarantee animal and plant life and health. These SPS measures are necessary, but can become obstacles to trade. This is where the agreement on the application of sanitary and phytosanitary measures, otherwise known as the SPS agreement, enters into the fray to strike a careful balance between the various interests. The SPS agreement aims to ensure that SPS measures do not restrict trade more than is necessary to protect health. It does so by emphasizing the role of science and of international standards in the design and implementation of members' SPS measures. The SPS committee brings together experts from all WTO members. They discuss SPS measures, trade concerns, and ways to address them. Finally, the WTO SPS committee discusses the provisions of the SPS agreement and has developed guidance on how to implement them. We invite you to take these four interactive courses about the SPS agreement. You will learn about the SPS agreement's relationship with other WTO agreements, its background, structure, principles and obligations. You will also learn about the work of the SPS committee, SPS-related disputes and the technical assistance available in this area. You will enjoy this fascinating subject.